family and welcome to Kitchenasium. For the month of October, I'm going to be doing a recipe and a review where I'm going to be making a spooky, spectacular treat and I'll be reviewing a Monster High doll. So I am very excited and so subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any spectacular treats and reviews. So let's get started. So today for the recipe portion of the review, we are going to be making spooky bones out of pretzels, mini pretzels, and mini marshmallows. And white chocolate. To start making these spooky bones, you're going to melt white chocolate. And I have already melted some white chocolate. And then you're going to take your mini pretzels and two for each pretzel of the mini marshmallows. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to dip the end into the white chocolate and then put my marshmallow on. Just hold it for a few seconds. to make it look like a bow. And then we're gonna dip it in white chocolate. Just dip it completely into the white chocolate. Wow, look how cool that looks. It looks just like a bone. I'm gonna finish up the rest of these, but I'll see you back when they're done. Wow, look how great these look. This is so cool, they look just like bones. And I'm gonna try one because I'm really excited to try these. This is so good. The marshmallow, the white chocolate, the saltiness of the pretzel. It's perfect. Simple and perfect for a Halloween party because it's quick and easy and tastes great. Well, thank you for watching this recipe and review this week. Don't forget to watch more Kitchenasium and follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. And subscribe, comment, and like down below. See you next time on Kitchenasium. Bye! showing you the Color Me Creepy dolls. Now, this is the Color Me Creepy sea monster. You're probably wondering how you're going to do it without the lap. Well, you still could do it because you still get pens. She is so much fun to use the Color Me Creepy because you can easily change their lipstick color, their eyeshadow. I think this is just one of the coolest things ever to Color Me Creepy. It just is so much fun. And the sea monster, she is blue, but it looks like she changes to a greenish gray. How cool. And then, I have the other one, and she is a Color Me Creepy werewolf. And she's pink, and she turns to orange. Now that's awesome. Once again, her lips and her eyeshadow changes colors, and you can choose in two pens. This one will freeze, so it kind of adds like, so you can add kind of like squiggly lines. But being a werewolf and all, I think these dolls are so cool. You can change the color of their hair. It's just a big wow, the Color Me Creepy. I don't know what I would do without it, because it's just so awesome. Well, thanks for seeing my Color Me Creepy dolls. Bye. Follow me at Emily's Kitchen on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. And subscribe and comment.